I'm Doug Stanhope, and that's why I drink. Your hatred of American culture culminated with you spilling billions of barrels of oil into the Gulf of Mexico. And I understand, yes, you don't like America, and we don't have a worldview, and we think everything revolves around us. But it was a shitty thing to do. The entire summer was BP oil. 81 days in, with BP still using dispersants, the first glimmer of the price that will be paid. Another day of the BP oil spill. Round the clock coverage of oil leaking. We have cameras on the oil spill. And now let's look at a close-up of the camera of the BP oil spill. Everybody's angry, angry about the oil spill. Man, you got to get down here and take control of this, put somebody in charge of this thing and get this thing moving. We're about to die down here. They have coverage of boycotts, people protesting BP gas stations. Well, you're irresponsible. BP got to go. Hey, hey. Oh, oh. You fucking drove to that boycott. <laughs> the car unless you're boycotting petroleum you're doing nothing i have a list of things that i'm concerned with and the oil spill is not going to make the list there's a lot of other problems in the world maybe someone kevin costner is concerned about the oil spill he built a machine the news picked up on this stupid story and ran with it. Meanwhile, the cleanup effort along the Gulf Coast, that is getting some star power. It is called the Kevin Costner Solution. Every day was just unending coverage. Those with a science background will find our machines easy to understand. They are designed to separate oil and water. Don't they do that by themselves? I'm going to build a machine that makes cats hate dogs. Dawn Dish Soap exploited this to a level that I found obscene. Dawn Dish Soap, just some dish liquid, had a commercial where they came out showing ducks or waterfowl of some kind coated in crude oil. Not today, they're going to wash away. And if you see the commercial, you see a duck covered in oil. Unless you're a complete sociopath, you're probably pro-duck. You're rooting for the duck. But you think the commercial, it's an environmental concern. Saveaduck.com. Throw us a dollar. No, it's for Don Dish Soap. We get your silverware sparkly clean, and then we save a duck in our off hours. How obscene, how vulgar is that to exploit a tragedy of this level just to promote some dollar store dish soap, is that not exactly the same as using a rape victim to promote a feminine hygiene wash? Take on wash, wait, it's all I'm gonna take.